A major concern for inhabitants of Bwankra over the years has been the lack of a decent public toilet. We are suffering from toilet in this town. At least we always go out from bush, someone bush, to go for toilet. Because we are suffering a lot in this town of toilet. I have been here about seven years. It's so bad. It's so bad. Because going to someone bush, even when we are there, there is almost women and men are always guarded going to toilet. So men see women private parts. It's not easy at all. Aha, nani yoko toilet. Oni o ko toilet kwa na be man suji na wachi. Ti se wan he in bokra. Ni wan ni akobo be man in bokra. Unti mi hu se o ko toilet. Oh I had drink. Se obu o ha uni mu no o ya ho ho. Nti u ko to ono no suji na wachi. Eti u hu se o ko toilet no. O kwa be fere. At Bisiyase, these women show me how some residents defecate close to their houses. And the stench from this is unbearable. The population within the Ejesu municipality is increasing, which means more pressure on the limited amenities in the communities. The situation is not different in communities like Donina, Esienimpon, Bonwe, and Akukwamu, John Ampontia Kuma said his constituents deserve better after he commissioned ultra modern toilet facilities in these communities. The idea is to build about 30 of these toilets because before I contested, I did a research of the community and found out that uh, number one problem was sanitation, lack of quality public toilets. So I partnered with private companies to build these public uh, toilets for the people. And so far, all the 30 we are building is 100% private funded. And so far, out of the nine that have been commissioned as of today, the 21 left have all been built, plastered, and roofed. So I believe by close of the year, we should be able to complete the rest of the 30 uh, toilet facilities. And it's going to be privately managed, uh, of course, with the involvement of the chiefs and the unit committee and the assembly, so that we can maintain the standards of quality that uh, we want. Uh, the objective is to achieve health, healthy uh, sanitation in all the communities in my constituency. And so far, it's been so good. He also discloses that similar existing facilities in other communities are also creating jobs for the youth. I believe that uh, if we encourage the private sector to partner with government, we'll be able to do a lot for our country without always relying on government to come and do projects for communities. We have to find a way to tap into private resources as a country. For residents of the beneficiary communities, the toilet facilities have come at the right time. It will help me a lot because I will not go to someone's bush so that men will see my private part. I said that I was a Dima MP. 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 There was excitement in these communities when the facilities were officially opened to the public. We have set um, a, a, a management uh, committee for this facility. And then um, what we do is that um, we periodically visit uh, the facility unannounced. Because so when we come and um, there's uh, uh, the place is not kept well, yeah, we ha um, we query the workers for them to do the right thing. If you are not doing the right thing, you know one or two uh, caution will come, and then maybe you dismiss you for uh, another worker to come. Residents of beneficiary communities are happy about the provision of these toilet facilities. Half is to journey. City News, Edison Municipality, Ashanti Region.